and welcome to another episode of Wu Bar. In today's episode, we are going to check how SNS can be used to trigger lambdas. If you're interested in watching more content like this, subscribe to my channel in the red button below. I post a video every Tuesday. Let's get started. <laughs> SNS. SNS stands for Simple Notification Service. It's basically a publish subscribe in the AWS system that you can use uh, for different systems to connect to each other without knowing. So that's the basic of the pattern. So there's huge decoupling. Systems publish to a topic and other systems are interested in some topic. They listen to it and they just get notified. So they don't know about the other system. So it's pretty nice. So we can use this for, for example, to connect two lambdas. We can have one lambda A that published to a topic and then a lambda B that is listening to that topic and gets triggered when something appears there. Lambda A is managing some order processing and lambda B is giving rewards to that customer when the order is going through. So when a new order comes and is processed, Lambda A will publish to a topic and then Lambda B will be listening. Oh, there is a new order coming and I will give some rewards to this new customer, for example. It's very hard sometimes to manage these Lambdas because these are totally asynchronous and they're totally decoupled. Lambda A is not aware of Lambda B and Lambda B is not aware of Lambda A. So when Lambda A executes, publish the message and it finished, it successfully finished if everything goes fine in it. But if Lambda B fails, then Lambda A is not aware of that. So you need to manage that kind of asynchronous problems in your calls. And also if you want to send a message back from Lambda B to Lambda A, that's something you also need to manage. So what a topic is, I mentioned that uh, before, a topic is just a collection of events or messages or whatever where the publisher published the message. So you can have publisher and multiple subscribers and the publisher is putting messages to this topic and the subscribers, whenever a new message is coming, they are listening to the messages. So to get started, you create the topic, you publish message and then you create someone to read those messages. Lambdas can be triggered by these messages. So when a new message comes to the SNS, then the Lambda will wake up and execute. And serverless framework allows you to use those SNS messages as events for your lambda. So we'll see that how is that done in the code. So what we are going to do next, we will create two lambdas, one that is triggered by this uh, message and one that is publishing to this topic. So first we are going to create the lambda that is publishing to the topic and we will create the topic and then we will create a lambda that is listening to that in the serverless YAML events. So let's go to the code. So here I have code for the two lambdas and the topic, and I will show you a little bit how this is done. So the code, as always, you can find it in GitHub. I will put the, the link in the description box below. You can also find it in the blog post that will come after this video. So we will start by the uh, lambda publisher first. So we will create the, the lambda publisher and then we will have the lambda triggered. So the lambda publisher basically gets uh, publish a message to the topic whenever it gets triggered by an API gateway. Then when we have that, we will go to the to the handler.js and there we just will publish a message. I have created a helper function for that and that's the one that is publishing to the topic. So I just get the ARN for that topic you can get it from the console, from the Amazon console. And it's basically using the library SNS publish. You put the message to the topic ARN and then you send. And the next one is just a lambda that gets triggered whenever a message to that topic is uh, being sent. So it's a very simple, simple lambda. So we can go to the SNS in the Amazon console. I don't know why it's in French. Mysteries of life, somebody can explain me. And then rubriques or whatever, that's the, 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 street, the topics we have. And we just can verify that the ARN is valid and make sure that that's the same. And then another thing we need to do is to set a valid role 
for this lambda to publish to this uh, topic. So we need to do that, don't forget. If not, you won't be able to publish events to the topic. And we just deploy. And you can try with the API gateway. Uh, with the REST client, you can call that lambda publisher and you can see that everything goes successful and then you can go to the aws console and check the lambda that is being triggered check the monitoring there that's the trigger lambda and then we can go to the monitoring and we can see that something happened so the message is test published to SNS Lambda, and the one that we can see in the console logs is test published to SNS Lambda. So that was the video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, give it a big thumbs up. If you have any comment, questions, suggestions, or anything like that, leave it in the box below. And around here, you can find content that is related to this video. And I see you in the next episode of Fubar. Ciao!